Are you experiencing design block on your project with no direction on how to present information to the users? Or you are a beginner and you do not know how to start your projects. In today's video, I will share with you 10 design resources that will get you started on your website, web application, and mobile app design projects. These resources include unique layouts, patterns, live websites, and mobile applications, as well as interactions that will inspire you in your projects. If this is something you are interested in, Stick around to the end of this video. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. So the first on our list is saslandingpage.com. So SAS landing page is a website, a resource that is focused mostly like the word landing page. Another great thing about these resources is the landing page is actually categorized to different sections. They have a new feature, which is an app inspiration for desktop app, like multiple flows, dashboard, list or tables. So this is like a very great resources for you to check out. It's Lapa Ninja, right? So Lapa Ninja is a resources for many things. But on this video, I'm focusing on the landing page only. Every website has been categorized based on the industry that they are. So we have SaaS, we have 3D websites, we have e-commerce, we have agency, we have apps, we have beauty. We have a lot. We have Web3, we have categorized by color as well. So, so now for e-commerce, you can see we have 764 e-commerce landing pages here. So you can boba ice cream and you can actually go to the website itself by clicking so now this is the website i'm at boba ice cream website so you can see us.bobaicecream.com so in here now i can see what the website is all about what the experience is Next resource is, is checklist design. This design is like the word checklist. It's going to give you a list of things that all your flow should have, a particular screen should have. Topic, certain topics, right, and brands. Okay, the next on the list is UX actually. So I love this particular website. I love this particular website because it's just like you have flows <laughs> on apps. So you have you can search for a particular any any of your popular apps, right? So you can search for flows on onboarding. You can search sign up settings. The next resource is design thoughts. This is let's just say the powerhouse for all the resources I've been mentioning. This is one of the great resources you can have access to. Resources cover both web application, apps, UI pattern, landing pages, websites. The next on my list is mobile.com. I'm sure you must be familiar with this and if you are not familiar, I'm happy to introduce you to these resources. So mobis.com is a resources for apps, both iOS, Android, and web. So one great thing I love about these particular resources is because it actually categorizes them based on their platform for iOS and Android. Now you can see similar patterns, like common patterns that Android has that iOS does not have. So apps means like the categories, you can filter by UI, a particular UI design element type. So the next on my list is Minima Gallery. So <laughs> Minima Gallery is one of those resources I recently found out about and I'm so happy I did. So Minima Gallery is a collection of Minima beautiful and functional websites. A great, a great resource for if you are looking for unique typography, unique layouts so there is no filter for you to filter based on a particular industry and you just have to like search through yourself so the next on my list is dark mode design just like 
the word dark mode. So this is a collection of resources in dark mode. Websites in dark mode. So you can see one great thing I love about this is with dark mode, there is a variety of a shade of black, a darker shade of certain colors, which kinds of educators that you do not need to use black for your website to be in dark mode. It just has to be dark. So the next resource is Stack Sorted. So Stack Sorted is for both designers and developers. And the resource is to find inspiration for unique design elements. Button. If I click here, it's going to take me to the code pen for, and this is for developers. While this other one takes me to the website that has the particular button. Stack Sorted is for small design elements. You can see border effects. You can see custom cursor and finally it's so the last resources so this is awards.com a platform that gives awards to unique functional websites they are very creative so you can see site of the day this means this is the site that wants the award for the day the great thing about awards websites is the way they use animations in most of the websites is so fascinating and it's this is the particular website and you can see how the website is designed and i love the fact that this is an e-commerce you was telling me my cat is this and my night nice mode is off so i just add that on and now i want to have this so you can see we have both light mode and dark mode and the Experience is just great.